Well, welcome back everybody. I want to take you back on a time lapse through this afternoon. It's been a dreary day. We had the rain moving through. We've had clouds. It's been a chilly afternoon and here's what it looked like earlier around 2:15. As you can see, heavy rain was moving across the city of Hattiesburg at Forest General, but it cleared out about an hour later and then we were left with the clouds for the rest of the afternoon and the sun is just about to set right here, but watch the fog. You can see it's starting to move in a little bit and look how it thickened up after seven o'clock and we have really been stuck in the fog here uh, ever since then, and it doesn't look like that's going to be breaking up anytime soon. A live look at what's happening right now 53 degrees. It's hard to see Highway 49, which is right down here, uh, but you can kind of make out the cars that are driving out at about this evening. Not only in Hattiesburg, but let's take a look and pedal to the Evelyn Gandy Parkway. You can see dense fog out there at the moment 52 degrees tonight at Leaf River Dental, and all across South Mississippi, we're dealing with visibilities down to as low low as three quarters of a mile. We're seeing two stations reporting that so far, or actually three, excuse me, uh, Moselle, Petal, and Columbia all are reporting three quarter mile visibility, but it is a very dense fog kind of evening. The humidity is uh, very high. It's right at 100% and that makes sense with all the rain that we picked up this afternoon. Some of you picked up rainfall as much as two to three inches of rain. I know I picked up just north of two inches of rain at my house. The Hattiesburg Airport picked up three and a half inches of rain, so definitely a wet Friday afternoon. And the fog's going to stick around throughout the rest of tonight, but it should begin to mix out of here tomorrow morning after sunrise. I think between eight and nine o'clock, we're going to see that fog uh, re uh, remove itself from the viewing area, and we're going to see some nice weather for tomorrow afternoon. Now during the morning, we start off your day with temperatures about where they are right now. Low 50s area wide, uh, 50 in uh, so so 50 in seminary, 53 in Purvis, 55 down in Brooklyn. But into the afternoon we go, you're going to notice this. Uh, we'll warm back up into the 70s. It will not be as cold as today. Tomorrow will be a little bit warmer out there. Low 70s area wide. We're going to see cloudy skies for your day tomorrow but it's not going to be a complete overcast day uh, like today. Uh, we're going to start to see some of the clouds mixing in uh, and some sunshine mixing in with that as well. So it's going to be a mix of sun and clouds for tomorrow. Temperatures start off into the 50s, but we warm up into the 70s by the afternoon. Uh, so the weather should be nice if you got to do any yard work. I can't rule out a random sprinkle tomorrow, but for the most part, we're going to stay dry for both Saturday and Sunday here across the area uh, and temperatures will warm back up into the upper 70s seventies uh, as we head into Sunday. Again, both days a mixture of sun and clouds, but we're going to start to see our rain chances return early next week and that'll begin as soon as Monday. So here we are Monday about a 30% chance of rain, but the better chance of rain moves in on Tuesday when the next storm system swings through our area and this is what it's going to look like rain will move in from Louisiana and that'll come in as we go through Tuesday morning, Tuesday afternoon, and we can pick up another one to two inches of rainfall with this system. Uh, early next week. So uh, we're definitely going to be in the uh, in the green department in terms of rainfall as we look ahead to the next couple of days. Uh, and as you'll notice, we do get a chance to dry things out by next Wednesday and Thursday. Highs, by the way, topping out around 80. But as they step out of the way, you can see another chance of rain moving in by late next week. All right.